Human waste has become a growing hazard across the city of Portland. Well, to try to tackle the problem, the city is proposing putting porta potties in areas of the city where they're getting most complaints. Our Jennifer Dowling is live now with what that pilot program might look like. Jen? Yeah, they'd start out with six to 15 toilets, according to the city, and then maybe grow from there. Uh, it's not clear exactly where they're going to put them, but they hope to put them in areas like this where homeless people gather and parks in order to get the most accessible places possible. I think it's a good idea. I stepped in some of that stuff once. Joe Shields is one of many residents who've encountered human waste on city sidewalks, parks, and on lawns. I think downtown's the worst, so as far as people just leaving their, their waste wherever. To try to get a handle on the problem, the city is taking bids from different vendors as part of a new pilot program to deploy portable toilets in different parts of the city. Early mock-ups showed some of the potties wrapped in colors resembling the PDX carpet and trailblazers. I honestly think that would be a great idea. Um, I know there's a lot of homeless people out here, and finding a bathroom isn't always the easiest. Right now, the city is seeking proposals for any company, any vendor who wants to help us tackle our human waste problem in the city. Spokesperson for the mayor's office, Eileen Park, says there are hundreds of reports of human waste filed with the city yearly. It's a sanitary issue, but it's also a human dignity issue. Not everyone is excited about the mock-up design. The president of the Portland Police Association, Daryl Turner, put out a statement saying, quote, the hardworking taxpaying citizens and business owners in Portland who roll up their sleeves every day and go to work deserve better than to see their tax dollars spent on a handful of portable toilets wrapped in local friendly patterns. Park says the wraps were only a mock-up and won't necessarily be part of the final pilot program. If they can make them work and maintain them, I think it's a great idea. And those bids will come in soon. They haven't officially started the bidding process, but that's going to happen in the near future. No timetable on exactly when the toilets uh, will be placed around the city. Uh, we're told that, again, the bidding process is going to start soon and nothing will be finalized until a contracted bidder is chosen. Back to you.